astronaut. Whoa, what? What are you doing, computer? I'm sorry, Astro Dude. Oh, uh, what's the matter with you, computer? You just let him leave. Hey, take it up with your boss. You can't leave because your mission on Mars isn't over, Astro Dude. Did you seriously program my ship to take control away from me? My higher-ups did. Well, relax! The end game of your mission on Mars isn't even that complicated. You just have to figure out a way to... to Wait, that's not complicated? I knew you'd understand. Finish this mission and you'll be free to leave Mars and do... Uh, whatever you want. But sir, maybe it'll be too late when that... Ugh... Great. Astro dude? So you were that Earthling on my surface all along? Hey, Mars. Did you see a spaceship leave your orbit? I didn't really notice. But nice to see that you're not freaking out about us anymore. Are you getting used to the whole talking planet situation? I don't even know at this point. I guess that's an improvement. So, what are you up to? I have to... Uh, yes. Terrible. So us Earthlings can live on your surface. Oh, seriously, dude? Is this why you're here to turn Wait, into hey, some I, I said hypothetically Mars. destroy me Mars, like listen to me. Hey, why don't we both calm no, down? No, thanks. Oh, Mars, come on. I've heard enough. Hey, who you Astro, dude? This conversation is not over, Astro, dude. Oh, great. Now the planet I'm on hates me. You couldn't wait until we were done talking, computer? No. Okay, so we have to terraform Mars in order to leave this planet and find Sar. Why do you want to find Sar? Because he's a rogue robot going rampage around the solar system. But let's put that on the back burner for now. Computer, give me the clip notes on terraforming. Terraforming is the process of altering a planet or moon's environment to make it more Earth-like. Which means? Creating a self-sustaining ecosystem with a breathable atmosphere, liquid, water, and a stable climate, among other things. Ah. Uh. So I'm in a hurry and my boss gives me a task that could take a couple lifetimes to achieve. It could take less if we have lasers. Lasers? Hey, Astro Dude. You better have some good news. Hey, Rotsar Rep Guy. Any luck finding me space oil yet? Oh, Mr. America! Uh, look, we haven't, uh... I know when someone's making a fool of me. I'm funding this mission, okay? Whatever it is you're doing can't be as important as finding me some gosh darn space oil! Astro dude, listen, I'm busy right... I need a giant laser to terraform Mars. W what? Mars has frozen water reservoirs and a lot of oxygen in the form of minerals. If we melt the surface with a powerful laser, we would release the water and oxygen, and after some time, it could turn more Earth-like. I have one question for you, young man. Who is this? Oh, wait, don't tell me. Is there oil under Mars's surface? Uh, maybe? Cool. My people will contact your people. Sir, what was that? I think we may be building the Death Star. I'm not sure. Guess who the mysterious Earthling on my surface was? Was it Paul Armstrong? Is he making a comeback? No! Astro Dude! Oh! I was wondering where he was hiding. And get this, he wants to terraform me. Earth? Are you okay? <sighs> Insecure. Probably your fault. 
Can you imagine having billions of humans with their virtues and flaws walking all over you? So much unconditional love spent on you. He probably has none to give to anyone else. And here we are trying to terraform Mars. Are you reconsidering your mission? What options do I have? You won't even allow me to leave this planet. Hey, Astro Dude! I have the money. Tell me how to build this laser. Okay. Uh, first, we need several mirrors facing the sun. Several. As in... A couple hundred thousand huge lasers around Mars' atmosphere. Yeah, <laughs> so cool. Okay, what else? We place those mirrors in space facing the sun, and we aim them at a satellite, which will absorb all of this solar energy. A satellite? Shouldn't we aim the mirrors at Mars? No. We need to focus all that energy into a single laser beam that will melt Mars. Ah, so we have to destroy the planet in order to live on the planet in order to destroy it. Sir, alive, baby. That's deep, sir. Thanks. Anyways, I'll get you everything you're asking for. See ya. <laughs>